All right, today we're going to do the basics of controlling your robot. To do this, we're going to use a quarterback. That way you can see all the functionality which is included in the arm. This is just like a video game remote. With the joystick, you can move forward and back. Unlike an RC car, when I press sideways, he's not going to do a long turn. He's going to do a pivot like a tank. So to get those long turns, you have to go at 45 degrees. That's you get that long turn that way. The other side of the remote here, these four buttons. The up and down arrow, those will move your hand up and down. This burst, the B is burst, so as I'm going, if I press it, it'll go faster. The H button is for hike, that's an advanced feature, you won't need it for a single robot. On the top of the remote, there are two buttons. This is the throw button, makes the arm actuate. When I'm pressing that, you'll see that the lights light up here, one through six. The more lights that light up, the harder he's going to throw the ball. So when I press it, they'll start. When I let go, it'll stop. So first I'll go all the way. Now I'll try and stop at a three. Oops. Okay. This other button on the top, this is switch. That's for switching between multiple robots. You won't need that here. If you do hit that, you'll see that you, you change to the green light here. You've stopped controlling your robot then. Just hit the switch again and you'll go back and now you're controlling it again. Those are all the basic features of the RFL AI01 robot. 